back out on the river finally after my shoulder surgery i had an unsuccessful day two days ago um just the fish weren't biting nothing was biting for me but i'm on the licking river below cave run lake fishing for uh bass musky trout a little bit of everything um i'm gonna get right to it starting out with a ned rig got a 10th ounce head on there finesse trd hopefully get something to bite Yeah, I do believe that is a warm mouth. Gorgeous warm mouth too. Wow. I think that's my first warm mouth in a long time. Boy, another big old, oh, wow, another big old war mouth. Holy crap. These are gorgeous. Should be some crappie or some sort of panfish. Been missing them, Lord knows that. Smallmouth or a walleye or something right there. <laughs> got it. Crappie. <laughs> so I've got warmouth, rock bass, and crappie today. Time to change batteries and keep doing that. I'm not gonna waste too much time. I'm gonna keep going down. I wanna get below this riffle. Got him. What do I got here? Little, uh, <laughs> little tiny, tiny smallmouth. <laughs> Love it. That's, uh, that's, that's hope. That's hope. Oh, that's not. Whoop. Okay. Big drum fall then, oh my gosh. Big old drum. Oh boy. I saw the drum come up, but I didn't see this rock bass. Wow. Now that's a good looking rock bass. Oh. Fat rock bass. I mean, you look good. You, you hold the weight well. There's a bunch of drum over in here. Before I start fishing for them, I'm gonna spray my feet. Because I'm gonna have a really bad sunburn on my feet. Come on. Oh, does he have it? That trap came up and got it right in front of me. <laughs> oh.
He's hanging out right here. Two or three of them right here. Wow. These trout are crazy. These trout are crazy, man. Ah, he had it. Got it again. Maybe they need like a horizontal movement. That's why I'm not catching them. That's what I'll do. Throw it across there. Just like that. There it is. Whoa, what an acrobatic trout. <laughs> cool. <laughs> That's what it was. They need like a uh, a horizontal movement across that channel. If I could get them off here without uh, turning around and losing my bearing. I'm in the rod holder for y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> well, come here, buddy. You're killing me. Come here. Come, come here. Old trout. Rainbow trout. Got my trout stamp, but I don't feel like cleaning them. I already got one in the freezer. Big one. Heck yeah, that's what it is. That, that's what it was, is the, the presentation. It needs to be coming across, not down. They need it moving this way. Add rainbow trout to the list of species caught today. As you can see behind me, it's a beautiful little avid eddy. Nice little gravel bar. Cool place just to relax. I'm gonna wade fish this for probably 10 minutes and then head on upstream, hopefully tangle with something bigger. Got me a bite to eat. Let's get upstream, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be a little less crowded upstream now. And I can actually fish where I wanted to fish a while ago. I just don't like, I mean, people that don't fish this a lot, I want them to have their chance. I'm always fishing here. But hopefully they'll be gone now. Ooh. Gotcha. Crappie? Oh, wow, big old crappie. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. Chunky boy. Chunky boy. Oh, no, did I get him in the kill plate? You'll be all right. Put some dirt on it. Whoa, wow. Well, they're starting to bite, that's for sure. Now I call these red-breasted sunfish. I think the actual name might be long ear sunfish. If I can get them up here. Holy cow. Okay, they're starting to bite, I wonder. Good grief. Yeah, they're definitely over there now. <laughs> oh, wow. That might be an actual bluegill. It is a bluegill. No? Yeah, it's a bluegill. <laughs> he hammered that. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> There's got to be. 
gotta be something right here. Tell me there's not a crappie or something here. Oh wow, nice crappie. <laughs> Knew there'd be one down there. <laughs> Heck yeah. Come on up in here, buddy. I knew you weren't going to last long on that hook. <laughs> Old boy's got some shoulders on him, son. <laughs> hmm. current that washes over a uh, sandbar here. Oh. What is this? A catfish. I got a channel cat on. <laughs> well, I got a freaking channel cat on right now. The little ones have really sharp Sharp, sharp fence. It's all right, fella. I ain't gonna hurt you. I've caught everything today. Everything today. That little Bobby Garland is the biggest multi species casting. Catching everything. I got water all over my face. <laughs> Catfish, trout, everything. It's, it's all on a Bobby Garland, man. I'm gonna drag a jig for a little bit and then go home. Good grief, that was a big old white bass. That was a hybrid bass. was a hybrid bass. Man, alive. I didn't think there were hybrids in here. topwater bass and go home. Something's coming towards it. Something's under it. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Tell me that's not a rock bass. That's a big old rock bass. <laughs> oh man. Comes with the bugs. Oh man. Somehow I got blood on them. I'm hurting this fish. I don't know how. Well, y'all, before I get carried away by the bugs here, I'm going to finish this day out. Got an early day at work tomorrow, and uh, honestly just want to get home to the family. But awesome multi-species day. Didn't get any sauger or walleye, um, and didn't see any muskie, but that's fine. Uh, I think I ended up catching largemouth, smallmouth, uh, rock bass, warmouth, trout, crappie, bluegill, all kinds of panfish, uh, and seen, you know, uh, either hybrid uh, or a white bass, a big white bass, if it was a white bass, come up and take a swipe on my bait. So, awesome day out here in nature, just spending time out in the kayak, enjoying the river again after my shoulder surgery. But I'm going to head back to the ramp. Um, if 
if you want more river action or kayak action just make sure to check out my other videos and hit that subscribe button if you already if you haven't already done so and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching